Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to install the No IP uh, Dynamic Update Client on the Raspberry Pi 4 with the Raspbian operating system. So the first thing you do is you go to Terminal and start it. You can start it with Control alt t Start the terminal and just type in the commands. I'll leave all this in the video descriptions. So you type in sudo su dash, and this will enable you to uh, go in as an administrator. And the next thing you do is I'm just going to copy it and paste it because I'm using one hand recording this. Go into this directory and then type this in or copy and paste it. I already have it, but I'm just showing you how to do this. Okay, that. And type this in next. I'm using one hand, so I can't type, so I'm just copying and pasting. Okay, now you go into the directory, press ls. This will list everything in the directory, and as you can see, let me move that up a little bit so you can see that. Um, you have to go into that directory, no IP dash two point one point nine dash one. I'm just gonna copy that. So I mistyped something. Okay, that's it. I made a boo-boo, so sorry about that. Okay, now I'm in that uh, directory, so I type in make. So make. So for me it's zero, enter. So now it asks for my username and username, which is my email account. I will type in here, Bradley. Now it asks for my password. Type that in. Okay, it will be used, so please enter the update interval. I'm going to select 10. Do you wish to run something at a successful update? I'm going to put no. Next thing you have to do is you go here and copy that. Okay, now, now we will update the client and that's it. Now it's running. So the good thing about this is um, you could just simply uh, use the dynamic update client on your VPN server. So if uh, 
your IP address changes and mine is a dynamic IP address so it changes once every month or so not exactly sure it may change once every couple of months but it does change uh, periodically so by installing this into my uh, VPN server um, no IP is going to get my uh, current IP address and it will send that to uh, the no IP website my account and update it so I don't have to do it manually and I don't have to use uh, DNS in my uh, router and I can't because uh, my router doesn't have um, doesn't offer the service for no IP it doesn't have it so this is the only way I could do it so this is the uh, easiest way you could do it and that's pretty much it so I'm gonna restart my computer and I guess that's it Actually, I'll just shut it down. Okay, thanks for watching. My Ace 1000KS1975 signing out.